bitch, that just can't apply it back. Yeah, baby, let me tell you, you so fine, you so sexy. Baby, let me tell you, you a dime, baby, let's be friends. I can spend this money on the time if you let me. So guys, before this video starts, I just want to put in this clip, um, just acknowledging the fact that I know that For My Fans 4 came out last night. Um, just know I saw it, but I recorded this video before that I saw that it dropped. So I did this song first. Um, I'm going to be reacting to the rest of For My Fans 4 later tonight. Um, so you'll see the video most likely tomorrow. Just wanted to put this clip in so people aren't blowing up the comments like, For My Fans 4, For My Fans 4. I know. Okay, I know that For My Fans 4 came out, and I will be reacting to it later on. Just know that this video was recorded before I saw that, so that's why it's coming out now. The rest will be out hopefully tomorrow. All right, thanks, guys. Enjoy the vid. What is up, everybody? It's your boy, King Boys Productions, and I am back at it with another reaction video. So today... We are here with Fetty Wap Cologne. This is an in-studio performance. Um, so look, I know I was gone this past weekend, or like this past week. Um, but let's be honest, nothing really dropped that was really interesting to me. And I also went home this weekend. That's why you see those letters back there. You know, your boy adding to the room a little bit. It's looking kind of fire. The KBP, it's a little, a little kind of off, but like, fuck it. I'm fine with it. You know, I'm probably going to be covering it sometimes when I like move my head around, but... It's still there, you know, we all know it's there. I'm going to try and get something else to, like, put next to it. I don't know what I'm going to put yet, something. But, you know, just kind of uh, keeping the room kind of popping. I know y'all can't see most of the room, but, like, you know, your boy's consistently adding new shit to the room. I got, like, posters right there. You can't even see any of my posters. Um, no, you can't see any of them. There's one up there above the awards. There's one over here. There's two right here. I have like a calendar over here. You know, your boys just, I like color, you know, like I like different colors. You know, these are like plain white walls. So like, I like adding shit to the walls that make it look kind of cool and unique. And it's my own personal space. So, you know, your boy does what he wants. But yeah, so I was gone this past week. Usually I post every Friday. Obviously I'm here a little early this week. Um, cause some shit dropped and I was like, fuck it. I'll just post early this week, you know? I'm sure no one's going to be mad that I post early, and shit, I might even post twice this week if, uh, I mean, if, for whatever reason, there's, uh, some good shit that drops on Friday or whatever, I might, might post twice this week, I don't know. You'll have to, t to find out, but I am wearing my Hobson shirt, but I'm not listening to any Hobson, because Homeboy hasn't dropped music in a while, but shout out Hobson, my Hobson merch, but, um, oh, almost broke my damn computer. Yeah, I've been having problems with my computer, um, so if anybody knows, like, anything about computers, I don't know if anybody does, but, like, it's, like, a storage issue. For some reason, like, the storage is, like, so inconsistent, like, some days it will have, like, 7 gigabytes available. Next time I turn on my computer, it's, like, 4 gigabytes, and I'm, like, I don't do anything on my computer. I literally just turn it off and then turn it back on, and it's, like, I ran out of space, and it's, like, consistently losing space. So, like, I'm down to, like, four gigabytes. I have literally nothing on my computer except for, like, the programs. And I have, like, four gigabytes left, and that's it. So, it's, like, it's fucking annoying, because it's, like, it's hard to do these videos when I don't have any goddamn space on my computer, but I can't even, like, edit photo... I can't even do, like, Photoshop or anything like that. It, like, doesn't let me. So. So. What if I told you? <laughs> okay. But, obviously, today, we're listening to Fetty Wap Cologne. This dropped earlier today. So I was like, shit, we gotta check this shit out, man. I'm excited. I mean, it's another song. I'm guessing this is probably gonna be the last thing he's gonna drop before the album. Obviously, who knows anymore? <laughs> like, who knows? And the, supposedly the album's dropping, uh, I think it's dropping on Halloween, is what I... The last thing I've heard is that it's dropping Halloween, so... Let's go. <laughs> like, Halloween is what? Well, it's Tuesday... From When I'm recording this, it's Tuesday the 15th. Well... Technically, it's Wednesday, because it's, like, 1 o'clock, but it's, like, Wednesday the 16th, so Halloween's, like, l like two weeks away, so shit. We might be two weeks away from a new album in this bitch. Alright, so let's get this song, uh, Cologne. I heard, like, he posted, like, a little snippet about it on his, um, on his Instagram, so I was just, I just thought he was gonna leave it at that, but he posted a full video, so shit, let's get it. Fucking packages. Yeah, babe. 
Uh, yeah, this studio is, is kind of fire, too. Like, I've never been to, like, an actual studio, but, like, this shit is cool. Like, this, first of all, this shit's, like, all After Effects, this shit right here. In case you're wondering how to do this kind of shit, but that's After Effects, but... This is just like a, it's such a cool looking studio. It's just like, it's pretty basic, but it's just cool. When I first seen her, know I had to make a mom. First I eat her, then I get her from behind. Damn, he said, first I eat her, and then I get her from behind. Ugh. Never live her, got her a second time. Hey, I don't know who edited this, but that was kind of fire, that little edit, the way that it was like, when it went the beat, the beat was like, tch, 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 and then in the video, he like, like it kind of like moved with the beat, that shit was cool. Hey. You know what I've always wondered though is like how many songs do artists record when they go to like studio sessions? Is it like do they like is it vary or like do they go and do like hella songs like when they're not in the studio they're like writing and and you know they have the beat already and shit like that but they're like writing to all these beats and then they book like a studio session and they go in and like do like hella songs or is it like you do one song finish that song and then you head out like i wonder how it is i wonder how like fetty does it because like i'm sure all these artists have like hella throwaways so like he how about he like records like six songs and only one of them he actually like enjoys or likes but also it's like you can't finalize I mean you can finalize the song but probably not in one studio session so This just has like a really chill vibe to it <laughs> look at these dudes just standing in the back like I don't, they just look so awkward like they're just like one dude's like this i don't know what he's doing he's like clapping or some shit like i don't know what he's doing or he was like he was like these and then he was like <laughs> like what is he doing and like the other guys are just not doing shit they're just standing there like i, I mean i understand it's like like this dude's like so like like bruh move like get out of the shot or like if you're not gonna do anything like i'd be like hitting some like this in the background like hey, no, come along. or something like just hit a move or something don't just stand there awkwardly like hey Hey, that graphic is kind of cool, too. That little Fetty Wap graphic. <laughs> this man just blew hella smoke in our face. Okay, I don't know. It. Oh, it was this person who ever shot this. Whatever. I think it said it at the beginning. It did not. It's just their logo. So whoever this is, shout out, shout out to them. It was a cool little video. It was pretty, I mean, obviously it was pretty basic. But I liked some of the stuff that they did with, like, After Effects and shit. You know, your boy is a uh, film student, as y'all should know by now. So, like, when I see, like, cool, like, video edits and stuff like that, shit's kind of cool. Like, it's pretty basic uh, After Effects stuff, but I don't know how to use that shit, so I would not be able to do a video like that. I'm being honest. Um, but, yeah, if you guys uh, did like, please leave a like. Please subscribe. Um, I'm, I'm guessing that, I don't know if this is going to be on the album. It seemed like kind of a short song. 
And it, I don't know, it really wasn't, like, it was a good song, but it, like, maybe it's going to be on the album, but my guess, especially since I don't think it's on, like, Spotify, um, I don't think it's on Spotify, I don't think it's on Apple Music, um, he didn't really promote it at all, like, on his Instagram or anything, so I think this might have been just, like, a throwaway kind of song that he shot a video for or whatever, and was like, eh, fuck it, I'll put it out, just for the fans. I think that's what this one was, in my opinion, this seemed like a video that he just put out for the fans, um, and didn't really, I'm not, I'm not, obviously it was a decent song, but like, I don't think that this is going to be one that's on the album, just because he, like I said, he hasn't promoted it at all, like, the only reason I saw it is because I have his like post notifications on, on, um, on, on YouTube, so I saw it earlier today, I was like, oh, what is this, and then, you know, all the, uh, the, the Fetty Wap, like, fan pages on Instagram and stuff, where, like, the homie 1738 Music was posting about it, and stuff like that, so you know that, like, I don't even, I don't even think Fetty even, like, mentioned it on his Instagram or anything, so, I mean, if, if this was, like, a, supposed to be another single from the album, you'd want to promote the hell out of it, especially if the album's coming in, like, two weeks, you'd want to promote the hell out of it, so I'm just guessing that this is not a song from that album, but it was still a good song, though, um, but yeah, um, if you again, if you guys did like, man, please leave a like and please subscribe. Um, leave some comments, whatever it is. If it's things you liked about the video, that's great. If you think if it's things you didn't like about the video, that's fine too. You know, leave some leave some constructive criticism. You know, your boy, I'm, I'm an adult. Like I can take some criticism. It doesn't bother me that much. And if it's like, obviously, if don't be a fucking asshole about shit. Like, there's no reason for that. But like, if you want to tell me something about my videos, like, oh, I don't like when you do this in your videos. Okay, thank you. I'm like. Thank you for letting me know. I don't like when you do this or this. This is stupid. You know, like, go ahead and tell me that stuff. That, that shit it helps me, and it helps me be a better content creator. And that's that's my ultimate goal. Like, obviously, the kind of the production value, I feel like, of my videos is pretty high. I mean, I have a high-quality camera. I have high-quality audio. I try to have, like, a, a decent-quality background. Obviously, like, it's my bed. So it's like I can't really do much about my bed there. But I try, like, the background to keep some cool stuff in the background and stuff like that. So, but yeah, I mean, if you if you have any constructive criticism, like, let me know. And then everybody that's enjoying the videos, please make sure to, like, like and, and share and stuff like that. Because when you guys like the videos, comment on the videos, like, share the videos and stuff like that, then it YouTube starts promoting my videos more. So, like, people that maybe don't know who I am will see me on their, like, recommended feed, and they'll be like, oh, what is this? And they might click it, and, I'm, and I'll pop up, and they'll maybe they'll become a fan and stuff like that. So that helps me out, even if you guys don't even, you don't even have to, like, I mean, if you guys want to share on your Instagrams or your Twitters and stuff like that, like, I would appreciate that. But, like, even just liking the video and throwing up a comment, even if it's, like, fire vid, you know, like, something simple like that, that helps me because YouTube's algorithm, the way it works, is, like, the more people are, are talking about a certain video, then they're like, oh shit, people are, people are messing with this video, I'm going to send it out to others, I'm going to send it out to others, because if people are liking the video here, I bet others will like the video, it's kind of, and the algorithm like learns and stuff like that, that's what algorithms do, is they, they learn and they adapt and stuff like that, so, but yeah, um, I also have a uh, promo for my show, if you guys don't know, I'm actually the executive producer of, it's a, it's kind of a, it's a show, but it's also like a movie, it's called Seven Deadly. That's like the Seven Deadly Productions is like our, our kind of like what we go by. And um, we have a movie coming out in the spring called Performance Review. Um, we're going to have a promo for that. It's going to be dropping later in the week. So I will I will let you guys know um, when that drops, probably on my Instagram and stuff like that. Um, and also, if you guys um, are interested in like following along with that, because again, like I said, I'm one of the executive producers on there. Um, you guys can follow that social media page. It's uh, Seven Deadly CMU. Um, I'll link. I'll try and link it down in the description below. Um, and then also in the description below is our last, the last film that we did, which was called Ever After. Um, make sure you guys go check that out, man. It's it's a really good. It's like obviously I'm pretty biased in the in the matter, but I I think it's a really good film. It's a really good film for being a student produced film and on a zero dollar budget. I f I feel like it's pretty good for a zero dollar budget and produced all, entirely by students. So. Um, make sure you guys go check that out. Follow my uh, follow the show's Instagram. Um, I do a lot of the social media stuff on there. So whenever you see like posts and stuff, usually it's by me. Um, I also have my other friend and also my other producer that does the social media stuff as well. But yeah, if you guys could go follow that as well, that'd be great. 
And, uh, yeah, like I said, the promo will be dropping soon, so make sure you guys are on the lookout for that. And follow my Instagram, and you'll know. I'll probably put some updates and stuff like that about the show and when you guys can, will be able to watch it later in the spring. So thank you guys, and until next time, it's your boy, King Boys Productions. Squaw. Back on my motherfucking shit, uh-huh. I got a lot of new drip, yeah. Just take a look at my feet, uh-huh. Look at my feet, yeah. You ride on my wave like a ship, uh-huh. I live my life like a movie, huh. You live your life like a clip, uh-huh.